literally one of the coolest things I've ever done on a cruise ship. Me too. Me too. Me too. Yeah. Previously, Fashion Island, beautiful Cozumel, Mexico. We're gonna come up here and get some lunch. Fish taco here, two chicken tacos. Everybody's really, really attentive. They're kayaking, so kayaking is included. <laughs> the only way to get here is by boat. That's the only way to get here, so. Food is absolutely spectacular. Man, so we are leaving. Back at the International Cruise Pier. Wonder how that got in there. Getting back on board. Here it is, guys. One last look. Cozumel sign and the beautiful brilliance and independence of the seas here in Cozumel, Mexico. So nice. Yeah, that's really, really nice. So that's the first thing we've had to drink since back at the beach, like oh, you're right. almost an hour and a half ago. Wow. And then by this time, yeah. Well, maybe like an hour ago. But yeah, no, it was a. It's been a. It's been a minute. It's been a hot minute since we've. Since we. Woo! Highly recommend that place as well. Playa Mia was super, super fun. We had an amazing day there at Playa Mia. Yeah. Really, really did. Wow. Here's our one of our last views here on land. I guess technically we're not even on land anymore. <laughs> we're on a man-made land. Yeah. <laughs> we're not on the ship, so I guess that makes us on land, right? <laughs> yeah. Getting back on board though. Beautiful, beautiful independence of the seas. We've, we've had so much. And you know, it feels like we've been on a lot longer. I was gonna say than it two feels days. like a longer cruise. Yeah. It does. Like it does already feel like we've been on maybe four days. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah, totally four or five days. Totally. Agree. And really, this is only our second full day. Right. You know, yesterday was our right. first full day. Today is our second full day. Tomorrow yeah. is our third full day. Yeah. And then between the first day and the last day, that makes our fourth full, full day. day. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they have towels. That's awesome. Yeah, they have the cold towels too. Look here, though. We're back on board the beautiful Independence of the Seas. Bye bye, Cozumel. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that was a lot of stairs. Oh, well, we are back on board, back in the room. What an amazing day we had out in Cozumel today. I just posted a photo over on uh, Facebook and Instagram. If you're not following me over on Facebook, it's Josh Hocum YT. Make sure you head over and you click follow and like on both of those pages so you can stay up to date on the behind the scenes stuff, the stuff that uh, does not make it here on YouTube. It always makes it over there on Facebook and Instagram. So once again, make sure you head over and hit those like buttons so that you can uh, catch all of that fun stuff. Right now, we're going to get changed up, head up top, because it's time for sail away for our one and only <laughs> port of call. That is the beautiful Cozumel, Mexico. In three, two, ah, there we go. All right, we're all better. That's a lot, uh, a lot better now. feel like a normal human being again. Okay, we've got to head down to the internet help desk really quick. Internet's not working again so we've got to head down and just see uh see if they can get that working for us because we wanted to do a youtube live for you guys you'll know if we get it working a few moments later uh, well we just spoke with the uh, internet people and they said the internet is down again again and they said it could be one to two hours before it's up and i mean normally that's not a you know that's not the end of the world i'm i'm not gonna sit here and on a Caribbean cruise vacation complain because my Wi-Fi is not working. I'm definitely not one of those people. The reason that we find an issue, it just seems like it's really only happening like when we need it. Like we want to be able to share the experience with you guys. And only then is when it's not working. Right. Like when we're in our room just scrolling on Instagram, it's working fine. Yeah. But whenever we want to do something like actually productive, Live. Yeah. never works. It's just the most frustrating yeah. thing. So we're heading up top right now to catch uh, the sail away from Cozumel. but I think we've come to a solution. So basically our predicament is that 
we the laser tag is happening today and today only and uh, it's going until 8 30 tonight but we have dinner at 7 30 so our predicament is we can either watch the sail away here from Cozumel which it is now 6 30 uh, so that'd be about a half an hour so then we have to get ready for dinner or we can go down and play the laser tag and then get ready for dinner and what Peter just mentioned he mentioned something really great he said you know we've cut we've watched you know a thousand sail aways but we literally get this one opportunity to do the laser tag so I think we're gonna go ahead and, and head down and watch the laser tag um, because it's lit yeah the fascination has left by the way here's the carnival valor right back there beautiful beautiful ship I need to get back on that so I can uh, do cruise vlogs on that ship. Right now I believe it's out of Galveston, either Galveston or New Orleans. Huh. Uh, but that's a great, great, great ship. Got to get back on that. But yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. So we're going to head down and play some laser tag yeah. because uh, this is our only opportunity to do so. So why not, right? You guys are coming along. Let's, let's hit it. blue here is oh such a pretty color really really oh look way down there's the fantasy you see it there she goes all right we are saying ciao to Cozumel we'll be back I know we will but until next time it's been real it's been fun it's been real fun all right see what this laser tag is all about I'm excited I really am excited to see oh my gosh I can already kind of see it looks like it's like black light laser tag or something yeah my goodness all right we're going in oh my gosh what, <laughs> oh my goodness. what is this madness <laughs> huh? this is insane You ready? Ready. Permission to set our Okay, guys, very simple. There are a few rules you need to know. Let's find out who's with who. Oh. So, purple towards the purple, guys, going towards the purple star. We're on opposite team. Purple. Go, 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 go. Bring it up. Bring it up. Bring it up. Seven, six, five, four. things I've ever done on a cruise ship. Me too. Me yeah. too. Yeah. That was like such an adrenaline. Literally one awesome. of the coolest things I have ever done on a cruise you ship. A you guys got to get down. You got to try out the laser tag. That was <laughs> spectacular. Whoa, look. So we're just now leaving. It's a good thing we didn't wait up there for all Yeah, this. I'm wow. so glad that we came down and chose yeah. to do the laser tag. Yeah. Yeah, because we would have waited up there for absolutely nothing. Yeah. And we would have missed the laser tag. But now this way. Yeah, I got both. Yeah. We've got both. Look at this. 
we've just left the beautiful port of Cozumel, Mexico. Oh, we had the most amazing day today. We really, truly did all the way up at Passion Island. The northern tip of... Yeah. So we've not even made it to the International Pier yet. Yeah. So we really have just... I mean, the International Pier is all the way down there by the trans -Carib. Weren't we at the International? I mean, the... You know what I mean. The Punta Langosta. Punta Langosta, yeah. Yeah. Wow, look at this view. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wow. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, look, we've just, we're the last to leave too. Yeah. Huh. Maybe that's why they were waiting. I don't know. I don't know if that or we were having trouble getting everybody back on board. They did make several announcements about it. Okay. <laughs> They right. did make several announcements about it, uh, about, you know, missing people and stuff, like, you know, blah, 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 can you phone guest services, that kind of thing, so, I don't know, but, um, in any event, Planet Z was awesome. You guys have got to, uh, get down there and, uh, and check it out it on your cruise. Hours, yeah, like it's free. Day. It's, yeah, free. it's free. Well, for our cruise, it was, it was for yeah. four and a half hours, today and today only. So you've got to get down. And total, I would say, total, I would say, time to a lot for it. We we got down there. Minutes. Yeah, I would say 45 minutes. The gameplay is about what seven, five to seven minutes. Ten. Huh? Yeah, maybe t yeah. five to ten minutes total gameplay, and then um, the the queuing. But uh, the queuing, the good thing is, is you get to sit down. Yeah. yeah. You get to sit down. It's in air conditioned. So, uh, but it was probably about another 15, 20 minutes. It so. was awesome. Yeah, it was truly, truly spectacular. All right, we've got to get upstairs really quick, get changed for dinner. We've got dinner coming up in about 15 minutes time. We're back down the dining room. It's gonna be something yummy. I just know it. dining room once again our third third meal I think so yes our third meal down here in the dining room um, for dinner tonight we've got an amazing view check it out here as uh, the sun sets it's right over there behind some clouds now as the sun sets as we sail away from Co uh, Cozumel right there mainland Mexico just beautiful there. Let me let you take a look at our menu tonight. Now, we do have some interesting options on the menu. Neither Peter or I really know exactly what we're getting just yet. Um, we've got to do some further reading and studying here to determine what we would like. But uh, here is the starters over here, main courses, and then all the way on the right, your desserts. Down here at the bottom, of course, you have the premium selections. So you can upgrade to one of these for the prices respective right there beside of them. Our yummy appetizers have just arrived tonight for our dinner here in the main dining room. Tonight, I ended up just getting the fruit plate again. And I've had tons of fruit today. I really have. Sure it's have. all been yummy, yummy fruit. That papaya was that exceptional was. at Passion Island today. It really, really was. And then Peter ended up getting a uh, Caesar, Caesar salad, salad right there. So we're both keeping it nice and uh, nice and simple tonight, you know? But why not for our main course, though? We both splurged a little. Our main course, I ended up getting the Caribbean jerk pork loin. So here that is, and it's got some uh, beans and mango papaya something on top. Some mango papaya sauce, I think. Then I ended up getting it with baked potato. Got some steamed broccoli there, and even some plantains there underneath, actually. So really excited about those. Then Mr. P 
Peter over here actually got the chicken parmesan, and that looks super tasty, Delicious. Peter. Delicious. It looks it. Look at that. Look, the noodles look really nicely well done. The chicken got an even layer of a parmesan, melted parmesan there on top. It's nice and crispy. Yeah, it does. Really it looks really, really crispy. Good. I'm glad. So we're going to eat up here, eat our dinner again with our amazing view here as we're sailing away from Cozumel. Cozumel's actually on the other side. This is mainland over in Mexico over here, but you know, you get it. We're going to eat up, enjoy our dessert, and then we're heading to Showtime. Showtime tonight is going to be like a variety kind of show. Um, it is, what I, I think you said five men, right? Three or five it's men. It's called the Edge Effect. Yes, the Edge Effect. Yeah, and I think they do like guys. music and, and, and action and stunts. They all do the music and voices with their, or music and, what do you call it? Instruments. Music and instruments and tones all with their voice. So it's supposed to be really, really cool, really magical. Can't wait to check it out tonight. I'm going to be honest. I was a little bit skeptical about tonight's meal. When we were ordering, I was like, mm, I don't know about this. But I am going to tell you what. It has been absolutely spectacular. This jerk pork loin here, honestly just bursting with flavor. I mean, it's it's... Uh, every single piece, not just on the edge, but it's like it's been soaked into the meat, the spices and, and herbs that they're using. So really, really yummy there. The plantain's also super, super flavorful and yummy. Everything on the plate here is good. And I think Peter's plate speaks for itself. <laughs> <laughs> Not much left of that, so you did enjoy that then, yes? Delicious. Good. Ah, oh, perfect. Beautiful. <laughs> wow. Oh my goodness. That looks amazing. Do you even believe that? Wow. Thank you. Thank you. I cannot even believe oh, this is a real thing. My goodness. Wow. Wow. Bone <laughs> appetite. <laughs> right. We are on our way to Showtime. Showtime down in the Royal Palace. Check out the Royal Promenade tonight. Beautiful. I do love the ceiling, how they've got uh, like the different, dip, not only the different color lights, but different areas that it's different colored. It really right. gives the illusion, if you're just walking down here, that it's very open. Yes. Like the, uh, almost like a skylight. Um, I really, really do love that. Um, we just spoke with guest services for a moment about the internet issues that we were having earlier, just because it's been happening frequently. When, when, when we were at dinner, the people next to us had internet, and we couldn't get on, so I was a little confused there, but basically they said there's something going on shore side and on the ship here, so they went ahead and refunded us. Um, I don't know if it's a partial refund or a full refund, but anyway, they've refunded something back. And so I just want to say a big thank you to Royal for doing the right thing, I think, yeah. at this point, you know. And when it just she was gets very nice about it. Yeah, very nice, very professional, very understanding, and I think that's the core of it is customer service. So big thank you to uh, Royal for going ahead and taking care of that. I understand that you guys have issues, and but I appreciate that you're still looking out for your customers and that kind of thing. So heading down to showtime right now, edge effect. What's going on out here on the pool deck tonight? Edge Effect was fabulous, just as suspected they would be. It's absolutely a fantastic, magical performance. So incredible, like their voices. I don't know how they made some of those sounds. You're in it. You're in it. I don't. Uh, I don't know how they made some of those voices, but it was spectacular. Ah, oh, look. Cozumel, just there in the distance. There she goes. What a beautiful, fantastic day we had today. We are, uh, we're heading back downstairs right now, but we're heading back down to Studio B. 
Um, we have got the Quest Game Show. So if you don't know what that is, um, it's interesting. Let's <laughs> go to it. Now, if you're running too fast, you fall over, you don't get any points. Here comes the next quest. We're looking for your team number and anything with the, and besides a C-Pass card, anything with the word independence on it. Anything with the word independence on it. <laughs> team number six. Team number one. We need you to find somebody, a man, change him into a beautiful woman. Find a woman, change her into a handsome man. Use lipstick, bras, hats, belts, boots, jeans. Well, you guys, that was the uh, amazing adult show quest. Now, I do say adult show because like, it is an adult show. There were some parts where it was actually nudity at one point. And I tried to show you guys the good stuff and, you know, kind of, uh, you know, not, not put that kind of stuff out on this family-friendly channel. But just do understand and be aware that if you plan on coming to the quest game show, it is an adult game show, so you will be, you know, seeing that kind of stuff. Uh, take place. Other than that though guys, I think that's where we're gonna finish out tonight. I've actually lost Peter um, We were just leaving the quest show and I thought he was right behind me and I turned around and he's gone So got to find him, but uh, this is where we will finish you guys out If you're new here and you haven't already subscribed, please consider subscribing right down below this video and ding that notification bell It's gonna let you know each and every time we upload something new something fresh right here on this YouTube channel tomorrow we have our final sea day here on board the Independence of the Seas. We've also got a ship tour, an exclusive behind the scenes ship tour. Hopefully we're gonna be able to take you guys into the galley and maybe one or two other places. So you do not wanna miss it. We've also got the Flow Rider and the Perfect Storm water slides and lots of other fun stuff coming your way. You do not wanna miss it. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys.